Hello and welcome back to Informatica's video knowledge base. Today we're going to try and clear up any confusion over address doctor reference data, going over what's needed for certified mode, how the correct certified content for USA can depend on the version of address doctor, and how you should obtain these files. For batch processing, you'll only require the file with BI in the file name. So looking at my files here, I have USA 5 BI. This is the format that the files will, will be named in. You can see here USA 5 C1, this is one of the certified files. Certified files run from C1 through 21. E is for supplemental data, and FC is for, stands for fast complete. For certified content, because our source for these reference files is the US Post Office, we're required to make adjustments to our software to accommodate new versions of content from the USPS. They refer to these versions as cycles. As you can see on this knowledge base article, we've documented that there are two main cycles that would be used in Informatica 9. Cycle M is in Mary and Cycle N is in Nancy. As you can see here in Informatica 9.1, Hotfix 2 and onwards, we're going to use Cycle N. The reason for this is because we've included an address doctor engine, 527 or higher, going forward in 9.1 HF2. Prior to this, they used 526 or 514, uh, which used Cycle M. So if you're still not sure about which version of Address Doctor you're using, the best way to find out is to go to the Informatica developer or into Power Center and run a mapping that uses an address validation transformation. I'm just going to do data preview on this AV transformation here. And then we're going to look at the log. The easiest thing to do is to search the log for engine version, one word. And you can see that it's, it's shown up in the back here, that my engine version is 529. I'm using Power Center and Informatica 9108 Hotfix 5, which includes 529. So I would use Cycle N. Another clue from the log here is the file dates. What you want to do is you want to go to the path section for your country USA and then go to one of these that are the certified files which means it'll, it'll, it'll be USA 5 C and then some number. In fact let's go to 21 since so that's the last one. So you can see that the start date is October 10th, sorry October 1st 2012 and had this been cycle M, the older version, we would see the file date something like 2011. So I can show you an example. So I've downloaded all of the cycle N content as well as the cycle M content in case I wanted to use this with an older version. Uh, so you can see here that the file dates are from August of 2011. Once you have the engine version determined for your address validation transformation, then you'll know which version or which cycle of the content to request from Informatica support. So you can open a ticket with Informatica support and our shipping team will help deliver the links for the correct cycle depending on the version of the engine that you provide or the version of Power Center. So if you have 901, then we'll know to give you cycle M. Once again, if the engine version is 526 or older, you'll need Cycle M certified content. For newer versions, at the time of making this video in 2012, Cycle M is the latest. Hopefully that helps clear things up, and thank you for tuning in to Informatica's video knowledge base.